Hello there, welcome to another Snapshot Showcase. In today's video, we're looking at Snapshot 21W16A. The first big change is, uh, is some textures have been slightly changed and tweaked on these blocks, these raw or blocks. Um, here is a comparison of how they used to look. Over here, uh, we have some changes to the azalea bushes, and that is that uh, we can actually go ahead and bone meal these and it'll turn into an azalea tree same with the flowered ones azalea trees look very cool the leaves are like all over the place oh one's two bone meals the the leaves are like all over pretty crazy do they always okay i was about to say do they always go to the same direction they don't uh but the sad thing here is azalea trees azalea trees need an update it's time for the azalea tree update uh, we need azalea wood, but uh, we actually get that uh, rooted dirt underneath uh, for one block there, so that is certainly cool. Uh, the next feature here, I won't really be able to show that well because it takes a long time, but um, under different conditions, you can actually grow the pointed dripstone. So pointed dripstone can now grow. Uh, basically, if you have it hanging on a dripstone block and it has water um, it'll actually drip down onto here now this can take several uh, like minecraft days um, but this one will grow and this one uh, can grow as well their max length they can grow up to is seven blocks um, there cannot be any blocks or liquids in between them like uh, here it won't cut through the block so no blocks or liquids, no lava or water. Uh, if they're waterlogged, like in water, they won't grow either. Here's basically the uh, part from the change log that talks all about that. Now, in this world I'm currently running, I'm using the uh, Caves and Clips data pack. There'll be a link to the, to the change log, or you can find it in the description down below. They updated it, so there's an updated version of it. And if we go down, we will actually be able to see, oh wow, there's like no caves in this world. Um, but we do have, we do have the new caves here, I think. Okay, so we apparently have a bug with this data pack where it doesn't actually generate caves. All right, so now we're in a brand new Minecraft world. The data pack is loaded. Let's see. And we have caves. There we go. That's what we're supposed to look like. Alright, so if we go all the way down here. Uh, remember aquifers um, from a few snapshots ago? Basically, what an aquifer is, in case you forgot. The aquifers are like these local water levels. Here's, I guess, a very small aquifer right here. Here's one there. So now aquifers now have a chance below Y0 to generate as lava instead. Uh, I don't know if these really count. All right, so this cave here looks absolutely sweet. I don't know if this counts as a lava aquifer. And I think this is the data pack causing me to lose some frames here. Obviously the data pack is still um, kind of in development as a snapshot is. Uh, I'm sure it will perform better as they make more iterations of it. Because this is actually just a second updated version of the data pack. I guess this would count as a lava aquifer. Uh, yeah, because I guess this might technically be a regular aquifer. I'm not sure. Um, but, yeah. Uh, maybe we can find a better example. Aha, here we go. Water aquifer. Lava aquifer, the world's tiniest lava aquifer. Um, I want to find an aquifer like this one here, but made of lava. Is that what this is? Is that what we have here? No, that's just a random lava. This cave, though, looks absolutely sweet. Look at these water aquifers. Just like these aquifers here, just like spilling out with glow squid. Hey, glow squid.
Also using this data pack, we'll be able to find new ore veins, which are going to be massive structures. There's going to be two of them, one for copper and one for iron. The copper one you'll find generating above Y0, and the iron one you'll find generating below Y0. They're kind of rare, but I believe I found one here. We can see the copper here with all the granite. So the copper ones will generate with granite mixed in, and they're going to be massively large. Uh, we, we can see there's just this big line of copper. So I believe that's what this is. They're insanely large. So there's just going to be like a lot of ore in them. So I believe that's what this is. I think it stretches all the way over here as well. Uh, now the iron ones, um, I'm not sure if I found, uh, if, if I can find any of them. They will have bits of tough mixed in, but they will look the same. Uh, for the most part, but with tough and with iron and they'll generate below Y zero um, Let me see if I can find one really quickly. All right I think very possibly I found one trying to generate in these like Pillars because we have all the tough and we have all the iron uh, There's some over there too. It's over here. And yeah, okay. This is definitely one of those veins right here and it looks like it's kind of generated in these pillars as well but this might be two of them this might just be some coincidental generation but it looks like one of them that's insanely large yeah and if we were to mine all these blocks we'd probably find more iron ore underneath but this is most definitely one of those veins right here so yeah those are gonna be a really cool way to get iron and to get copper it's actually gonna be it for the snapshot if you liked the video of course go ahead and leave a like and subscribe if you never want to miss out on a new snapshot video every single wednesday at least all the wednesdays that a new snapshot comes out then make sure you don't forget to ring the bell uh ringing the bell will give you notification every time i upload so you'll get to see all of my other cool videos but you'll get to see snapshots as well of course in the description there's a link to all my social media and there will also be a link to the change log so you can check it out for yourself and so you can download the caves and cliffs data pack sadly it only works in the snapshots. It doesn't actually like create caves in 116. I tried it. I was gonna make a whole video. But that is the video by the way. So if you liked it, leave a like. If you liked it, subscribe. And until next time, goodbye everybody.